the two triangles shown below are similar. Identify their corresponding sides and angles. So we see here, based on how it's marked, that this angle is equal to that angle. This angle with two arcs here is equal to this angle with two arcs here. And this angle over here with three arcs is equal to this angle with three arcs over there. So that's how we can identify which angles correspond to which other ones. So for example, angle, angle CAB, angle CAB corresponds, corresponds to this angle over here, which we can call, which we can call FDE corresponds to angle F, D, E. If we say angle A, B, C, angle A, B, C, this corresponds, so now we're looking at this angle right over here, angle A, B, C corresponds to angle D, E, F. Angle D, E, F. And then finally, angle B, C, A, angle B, C A, which is that angle over there, corresponds, we look at the three bars, corresponds to angle E F D. Corresponds to angle E F D. Now when we think about corresponding sides, and let me color code it actually. That'll make it a little bit more interesting. Side A B. So let's say side A B. Side A B. Segment AB, I guess you could call it, corresponds to what? Well, you can tell by looking at the angles. This is the side between this one arc angle and this two arc angle. The side between the one arc angle and the two arc angle. It corresponds to side DE on this triangle. The segment to segment DE. Then if we look at, at BC right over here, if we look at BC right over here, BC corresponds to, it's between the two bars and the three bars, between the two bars and the three bars. It corresponds to EF, EF. Another way that you could think about it is that this blue side is opposite this angle, angle EDF, so it's, or FDE we called it. Well, we called it FDE over here. It's opposite an angle, and it's opposite this angle, the one arc angle, the one arc angle. This orange side was opposite the three arc angle. It was opposite the three arc angle. And then finally, if we look at this side right over here, AC, AC, it corresponds to, well, it's the only one that's left, but it's also, AC is opposite that two bar angle. Opposite that two bar angle is right over here. It corresponds to side DF. This corresponds to side DF on this smaller triangle right over here. And we're done. We've shown all the corresponding sides and angles.